I did it all. I did it all. Got into a good school. Got superb grades. Did work that wasn't mine to learn professionalism. Day and night. Slept too little. Made myself sick. Lived on the edge of wanting to live for many years. Held it together at home. Kept it together professionally. Graduated top of my class. Got awards, distinctions, press coverage. Got the qualifications. Went abroad. Did the internship. Real life work experience too. Worked harder. Stayed up longer. Tried not to die. Still kept it together. Against all odds I worked. And I got pushback. So much pushback. Because of who I am. What I stand for. My success. Because people kept insisting on calling me a woman. And blaming their experiences on me. Got manipulated. Got used. Abused. Stalked. Forgot how to function, but kept sending applications. Applications for internships. Applications for art events. Applications for residencies. Competitions. Applications for jobs I wasn't qualified for. Qualified for. Overqualified for. Made a slick CV. And another one. And another one. And another one. Portfolios too. Artistic selections, digital selections, downgraded quality, taught myself tech skills, sent emails, more emails, more e Took pictures of myself, looking confident, because I know what I'm doing and what I'm capable of. Always have. Did my hair, painted my nails, shaved off my beard, put on lip gloss, blush too. Ran my small business of selling t-shirts on the side. Kept producing work for Instagram, a platform that blocked me and limited my outreach, despite me working hard to make it work. Get maybe a little bit of living like some of my pals do. But I got the same reply. You're not enough. You're not enough. Exercised. Ate right. Exercised more. Beat my hips. Pretended to be a woman for however much longer I could stand for. Gave it all up. Left people behind. Applied to cleaning jobs, went to the job center, went to the benefit center, listened to talks, went to the job center, listened to people older than me explain to me why I am not successful, listened to people older than me offer advice, listened to people's success stories who forgot that I am trans, listened, I am done, end of line. You say the world is a tough place now that it's time for me to face the real world? I don't remember a time when I haven't. I don't remember what real safety feels like. You say I work too hard. Not all of us get to rest.